Hello, Assalamu alaikum. Today we will learn how to make a smart irrigation system. Then this is the project in which we will make the simulation in the, on the Proteus software. In this project, uh, we are using these components. This is the Arduino UNO, this is the 16 into 2 or 20 into 2, um, which you want the LCD, then we have to connect that LCD. And this is the ultrasonic sensor which is connected on the top of the water tank which will tell the level of the water in the tank. And this motor is the irrigation motor which is connected to tank to the field which water the field. This is, this is the motor which will on to water the field. And this motor is when this motor is for the tank when the tank water is uh, become slow then this pump will become on to fill the tank so this tank is water tank pump and this is the moisture sensor this moisture sensor will tell the soil's moisturity level if the moisturity level is less then the, the then the irrigation pump will become on automatically when the moisture level becomes uh, higher then it will automatically off the irrigation pump so this is the automatic automatically 100 percent and in this project we are also using a gsm module this is the gsm module in which we are using a sim card to to send the message or to receive the message from mobile so the, in this project we are also using this gsm module it will do the mess uh, do the work of sending the message from this uh, project to the mobile so this is the arduino it will generate and the message and it will send to the gsm module then gsm module will wirelessly send that message to our mobile so that we can monitor the our smart irrigation system through mobile so this is the our project so now we will go to the program file what we upload in this arduino uno so this file will be on the in the description i will give the link in the description of my github you can download or copy this code from my github so now we will go to my github this is my github there are uh, many projects i have created you can also visit them now we have to uh, we want to a smart irrigation system arduino code so now we will click on this file it will open up this uh, sketch or code now we have to copy this code now we copied it now we will go to the arduino ide and here we will paste it now we will understand first this code in this code we have required these three libraries one is arduino uh, liquid crystal and second one is software serial and then wire datage if you have not uh, included these libraries then this program will give you a, an error you have first uh, download these libraries from library manager go to sketch then include library then go to manage libraries from manage libraries you can download any library so now uh, we will go to the the next uh, instructions in this in these instructions we define pins what we are using you in the uh, microcontroller so we are using 98413 a0 now we define these now we are using the gsm modules on which uh, pins we have to connect then we will define these pins and uh, what pins we are connecting lcd to microcontroller then we will define in this function now in the void setup in the void setup loop we will define the pins 
mood and uh, some instructions which will run only one on single once on single time then we will initialize a initialize lct and gsm module pro 96 baud rate and uh, then the main program file is start from the void loop this is the void loop and in this this uh, void loop will run every second in until infinite time so this is the, our main program which will run so now we have to generate a hex file for uploading the hex file in the simulation microcontroller so for the hex file we have first uh, include the what in which uh, microcontroller we are uploading the hex file then we will select that microcontroller from the from here select other board if uh, you are using other board i am using arduino uno in this simulation already you shown here so now we will go to the file and then go to preferences and then check the file compile option click ok now we will run this program it will generate hex file so now we will just copy the hex file location hex file location and then this location will be paste in the simulation microcontroller to run the simulation correctly so now we will double click on the microcontroller and then we will paste this file location to in the file in the program file then click ok now you have to remember two things one is uh, you have to upload a hex hex or hex file in the ultrasonic sensor dot hex file location so this um, from where we have to this file when you install these libraries the ultrasonics library or this mo soil moisture sensor library then there are two files which uh, in which one is for the library of the proteus and uh, the other file is the hex file so then we have upload that hex file from there so if i have the hex file is here in the library in the desktop i have a file named arduino proteus libraries now here is the ultrasonic sensor library this is the ultrasonic sensor library then there is a ultrasonic x file so then we will upload this file to this ultrasonic sensor is like it this is the soil moisture sensor we have upload that uh, hex file in this soil moisture uh, sensors hex file also so i am already uploaded that file in it so we will i am just clicking on ok now we will run this simulation to see the working of it after running the simulation the output will be shown on the virtual terminal this virtual terminal output will be sent to our message so this is the output in the message it is showing my mobile number and message on which mobile number it this message will be sent so this is the thing now you can see that the water tank level is 0% and soil moisture is 35% 35% is uh, so less if it will increase up to some point now you can see this is the increasing up to 86 percent now it is so much so the irrigation pump will automatically off 
and this message will print it on the LCD as well as it will send to my mobile irrigation pump is off if the water tank level is uh, becomes high it means it is filled now then it this pump will also or becomes off you can see now on the LCD that the water tank pump is off and the water tank level is 97 percent uh, means these uh, messages will be also sent on the mobile number these are the printing that irrigation pump is off water tank pump is off these messages will be sent to the mobile so if you have any trouble using this or making this project then let me know in the comment section i will be answer your question if you get this video helpful then like it thank you